yes let's make sure you click oh oh yes and then you oh, yes okay let's resume hi guys d sims here and welcome back to the channel and today i bring to you another decorating video today we are making golden records recording studio i've been needing to make a recording studio for a minute for my um jc 101 series I actually need it for the next episode which is why it hasn't come out yet because i just needed to do this build and i'm so happy that it is done but it is a recording studio that you can bring all your musically talented sims to um i'm going to be using this um more of for like machinima type purposes or storyline purposes i should say but you definitely can bring your sims here to learn the music production skill from Get Famous. So if your Sims is like making music and beats and things like that, um, singing, acting, anything you could do on the microphone, uh, guitar and piano. So if you want your Sims to like record music or, you know, just have them write songs in a different area that's not their house, of course you can bring them to Golden Records. So the name Golden Records came from someone in the stream because we did build this over on my Twitch channel. Definitely go and check it out. Um, we just be vibing and having a good time. I pretty much start all my builds on Twitch. It's just really fun to get everyone's input and things like that. I actually had this build planned out for a while. As you can see, there was it was to the point where I had the terrain paint already on a lot because I knew exactly where I wanted to place everything. And I had kind of did like a test, a test build to kind of see how everything was going to look. Um, because this is something, this is basically inspiration. Uh, this okay this build came from a picture inspiration and i just kind of wanted to see if i can build it in the sims and i love the way it turned out it's so nice it's so cute i've been talking about how i struggle with a non-residential lot so community lots retail lots things like that i just really struggle with them because i never know what to add to make it look more of a community lot and not a home but i really feel like this one was really this one came to me really easily so we have two recording studio spaces um where your sims can either produce music or they could be in like the recording booth so there's like two of them i wanted to do like a normal size a normal session where you would probably just pay like a basic fee versus like a premium session where you would have a bigger space and more room and things like that. But the recorded studios are pretty much identical. I think the second one that we decorate is a little bit like literally one tile smaller than the other, but I absolutely love the vibes because I definitely wanted them to be vibey because in my JC 101 series, it's all about being in the right mood to write the best song. So in my JC 101 series, um, it is about my sim in university and she's a music major. And basically um, her campus is having like a talent show where if the, where the winner of the talent show basically is getting sponsored by this record deal and could potentially put out their brand new single, like professionally produced and things like that. So this is really big for JC and her mother is actually known for music production. So the reason Naya was famous in the end was because she started getting into um, making music and beats and instrumentals and things like that. And that's where her fame comes from. So Naya is going to be basically making a beat for JC to make sure she has the best chances of winning this talent show slash record deal because this is absolutely huge for JC. JC, she sings around campus all the time when she's not distracted by her boyfriend or just other guys in general, when she's not being a boy crazed teenager in college, she tries to focus on her music. So Naya is kind of beating her into shape. Like, look, if you want to be serious about this, you have to, you have to have the dedication. You need to dedicate time. You need to be um, what's the word I'm looking for? Like you need to get your ish together, basically. <laughs> I can't think of the word right now. It's just escaping me. But she just needs to dedicate a lot of time. She needs to be working and she needs no distractions. She just needs to be, she just needs her amuse to just write her song and focus on her song because in the series, I think she has like three days to come up with this beautifully, you know, piece of music that can potentially win a talent show. So that's the little backstory with this space. 
um it is very basic we have a a nice lobby and we have some bathrooms and then we go straight into the recording studios it's not a whole bunch of extra stuff it is literally a recording studio straight into the point because like i said i needed this build for my series and i'm trying this new thing and i think we've been doing really good with it is not like letting my builds take freaking forever to decorate because we need them for series so um i've just been trying to speed up my build process i i haven't i don't feel like i've like stopped cluttering so that's good you know because it takes time sometimes to clutter but i'm just really familiar right now with my game and what's in my game so it makes it a little bit easier when trying to clutter or decorate a space you know what you have or you know what you don't have and you can go and like download and look for it and just be about it like already i've built a music studio before years ago back when i was doing the big sister challenge so i kind of took nothing has really changed from them you know it's kind of the same thing but i am really excited how it turned out and i can't wait for y'all to use it in your game but yeah this is pretty much the build it is a very i wanted to do like this eco contemporary modern i don't even know if all these words go together but you know i kind of wanted to do like this sleek design so a lot of modern windows and the different platforms just give it that that model again this was all based off of inspo pick so i wanted this greenery and i actually did a little bit of landscaping and kept it in the video for once who am i who do i think i am because i never do that but I think it came together really, really nice. And I can't wait for y'all to see the decorating. But I want to go back to the name of the studio, Golden Records, because the interior or the lobby for this place, a lot of the interior just has these black and gold elements. And it is literally so nice. I think this will be good in people's machinima series or story, you know, storytelling series where you need your sim to just be in this nice music studio. They can vibe out and they can record their songs and things like that. It is definitely the vibe. I put a lot of different lighting and neon lights in here so you can like change things up. I didn't want the recording booths to be too distracting because you know, you really need your something to get in here and be about the business and that's about it. Um, I did set this lot as a lounge, but when I was player testing it, I don't think I'm gonna be doing that just because there's so many people walking around of course, because I'm using this for storyline purposes, more than likely I'm going to be changing this to a generic lot. But I think this could be like a, a good art center, maybe that you can keep in your um, world for that came with San Mashuno, so City Living. I think the art center is a part of that. So I think that's where all of the paintings and it's just like a big creative space for your Sims to like do all their creativity and type things. You might need to add like an easel outside or some things like that. Because I think those art centers do require... Oh, wait, actually. Well, yeah, I think they do require the painting, like things for the painting skills. So you might need to put like an easel or something outside. But I ended up doing this as a lounge and I hid all of the objects that I didn't use, like a dining room table and love seats because we end up putting sectionals everywhere. I just kind of sized those down and just put them in like a random wall space we weren't using. Um, just to make sure that the lot qualifies. But I definitely do think it'll perform better as a art center. But you know, you never know who has all the packs. So I just decided to do it as a lounge because I think lounge is base game. You don't need any extra packs for that. But yes, like I said, I was so shocked how the little community space comes together. I really was like, what can I put down to make this look more like a community space? And I think that's what I need to play around with, like having trash cans and benches and just like things you would see like on the street like you know steam grates or you know mailboxes phone booths and different things like that to make it just adding the things you see out and about to your to your space will definitely help I feel like sometimes I create so many like um residential lots like I just forget like I just feel like I miss out on <laughs> I miss out on the whole like what can make this a community space type feel but definitely like adding pathing your landscaping definitely helps trash can benches light poles um anything you I guess you would just like a lot of stuff in the bug will help as well but you know I did I, I tried my best 
I tried my best to do the best I can and I love it. I think it looks so good. So right now we're just moving on into the bathrooms. Like I said, a lot of this stuff is just strictly what it needs to be. There's no extra hustin, like there's no extraness. It is a bathroom, two stalls, you know, some sinks, moving on to the lobby. I really didn't want this to be like, like extra, cause it just didn't need to be. The whole point of this is the recording studio or like the actual, like the, the, the recording booth and the area. So that's what I wanted to focus on. But I did want the lobby to be, I wanted the lobby to set the tone for the entire build. So that's technically the first build. That's the first room we started building. And it came together really, really well. Like I said, I love the gold, the bronze color. We used a lot of the Modern Lux kit. One of the best kits out there. Like I love everything that came in that kit and it was just perfect. So I'm gonna hush and shut up and let y'all sit back and enjoy the rest of this build. There are some pictures at the end, so make sure you stay tuned for that. This build will be on my Patreon very soon. So if you want to pick it up, you can look for it there. And of course, it'll be available to the public shortly after that. But thank you guys so much for tuning in. I will see you guys in the next one. Remember to stay beautiful, stay lovely, stay in the house and have a grand, grand day. Bye guys.
I've been down in the ruins so deep. All the games they have played, all the love you've forsaken, you let it slip away. Oh, 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 oh. you don't care what you're doing to me. Every setback, every mishap, every time you say you're gonna change. Say you get it, you regret it, I forgive it, but you stay the same. You should cry an ocean for me For the dumb shit and the damage you've done Cause I've been crying oceans for weeks Try to fight it but I'm drowning alone Sister save me now Save me now Whoa. Sister save me now Save me now Whoa. Shed a tear for me, baby, if you dare Maybe then it would show me that you care Cause your words never match what you do How you act so I can't just take you back Disguise 